Hey, and welcome to our Kivi tutorial where we talk about formatting. Today we talk about how to center a layout within another layout. So how to center box layouts or grid layouts within an anchor layout. Check it out. So in the previous video, we talked about centering widgets, but what if you want to center an entire layout within another layout? So in this example, we'll show how to create a box layout and then center that box layout in an anchor layout to create a nice border around it. So what do we have so far? I've created my basic app here. Um, the Python thing we're not going to be looking at, that just calls the GUI uh, here on the right hand side. So what I've created so far is a box layout with uh, a vertical orientation. I've given it a background color and I've given it a rounded rectangle. My background color is white, a radius of 20. And then I have three labels, one, two, three, with three uh, bluish colors as backgrounds. And um, they also have been rounded, all three of them. The text is simply label one, two, and three. And then I apply some padding to make sure that the labels don't go all the way out to the edge of the box layout this box layout here and also some spacing between the widgets such that you can see the white background of the box layout between the widgets then further down here i then call my box layout as the root so what does that give us so we have a box layout with the three buttons stacked vertically we have some padding between the edge of the box layout top and bottom and left and right and we have spacing between the labels and you can also see the rounded corners and they're just rounded enough to see that the background of the box layout is white but the default background is black and we haven't changed that so that's where you can see the um, background of the box layout now what I want to do is I want to stick this box layout in the center of another layout such that um, we can have another nice frame around it. So what I'm going to be doing is I'll be creating uh, an anchor layout because an anchor layout is, um, is, is easy to use in the sense that you can tell it exactly where you want this box to go. So you can say, well, it's going to go in the middle or you can say it's a top left corner or wherever you want to position um, your layout or your widgets for that matter, you can use an anchor layout. So I'm just going to create an anchor layout and that is going to inherit from anchor layout. I'm going to create um, a background as well. So I'm just going to copy that. It's going to be a, a normal background, not a rounded one, just to show you the difference. I need to make sure that is indented correctly of course i don't need a rounded rectangle i need a rectangle and in terms of colors i'm just going to have gray okay so that should create my um gray border around what what am i going to anchor well i'm going to anchor my box layout so make sure that aligns with that and so my box layout is going to sit within this anchor layout. Now, the thing to um, explain here is that for anchoring, you need another uh, variable or a property. You can have anchor, which is both the X and the Y, or you can just choose Y or X. I'm just going to do both and have both be the center. So I want the center horizontally and the center vertically. Then I'm going to call my box layout from within my anchor layout. So my root is now no longer my box layout, but it's my anchor layout. So I can call my root there and see where we get. So now you have exactly the same as before. When you can see is this black has turned to gray. Um, okay, so it's working, but I want this to be a bit clearer. I actually want the gray border to be much much bigger so then as usual I need to apply padding such that the widgets or in this case 
um, my layout so the children of the anchor layout don't reach all the way out to the edge of the anchor layout so and I'm going to use quite a bit of padding to show you the, the border clearly um, there's no need to do spacing because within anchor layout there's only one child and the important thing to say here um, in the previous videos we showed you how to deal with centering of widgets within box layouts and grid layouts where the padding applied to all the individual widgets and so you had the same padding for each widget here for an anchor layout all your children so in this case I only have one but if I had multiple children they would all be anchored at the same point so this is where you have to be careful um, how to how to use it you have to use it correctly if you need multiple widgets below each other to be centered um, or to be left aligned or right aligned then you effectively need to create uh, a grid layout with anchor layouts within it we can touch on that in a later video if you want me to please leave a comment uh, and I'll I'll do another video on that later but so for the moment um, we've introduced some padding so let's see if that gray border is any bigger so there you go now you've got quite a chunky gray border and that is your anchor layout you then have your box layout in white with the three labels so that's how you can center a layout within a layout to create a border or just for it to sit nicely in the middle of a screen hope you found that interesting and helpful see you in the next section of this tutorial bye